Good morning, sheep fans, and we're going to be clapping in Orkney today. Good morning. Good morning, sheep fans. So today I am at Orgel Farm on the island of Hoy in Orkney. Today we're going to spend most of the day gathering the sheep off the hills here in preparation for Cami coming up. Well, he's coming up this evening to shear tomorrow. Today's task is the green craig over there. The sheep kind of grazing right up the sides of those craigs and around the, the, the base of these hills here in Hoy. They're Shetland sheep. They're, they don't behave like normal sheep. And they're very, very tricky to gather. So the plan today is to, I don't know if you can see, I uh, go up in between the two of these peaks here. We'll walk right round the basin at the back and right round to the peak of the craig and come down on the sheep. So as we spook, spook them back to the stadium, in the way, if we was, if we was to attack them from below, and like send a dog round, the, the sheep's just far smarter to the land than we are and they would spook the whole way to the top and they would go and hide in wee nooks and crannies where we couldn't couldn't possibly get at them so yeah that's the plan today so folks just a wee update here on the gather um we've scaled that peak that you saw behind me in the first video and the plan now is to follow the peak right round the back there and we'll come doing these landslides try and come down on top of these sheep um i'll try and pick them out for you but it's uh those wee dots on the side of the hill there that's not actually rocks that's sheep you can see a few more of them there um like i say if they got a spook in from below they would just take off right up the, those cliff faces and we'd have a hell of a job getting them in so if we drop down behind them spook them home should go okay so that's us kind of in place for spooking the sheep in the right directions now um, as you can see down here you'll see how fly they are uh, that's them down in these gills but they'll think they're hiding away but i'll uh, i'll get the hunt away noising up and they'll start flocking together and uh, they'll follow the base of that hill the whole way around back to Oregon. And then in the afternoon, uh, we'll actually have to gather this hill out here, just past the green heathery stuff on the horizon. There's a good few hundred sheep up there too, we'll gather them in. But uh, I'm staying back with the dogs, just for the, the edges here, just because you don't want to lose a dog over the craigs. But um, more geography. Uh, island of Cremsey and that's the hills of Orpha in the background and just in there is what they call Scarpa Flow, um, the big naval base back in the war time. We well, really have to be up here. Uh, it's unfortunate that Cameron was just busy with shearing south. At the moment he could have came here and he would have gotten far better footage than me but Hopefully it gives you a wee, wee bit of insight to some kind of hill farming in the islands. It's a non-sheep related topic for the sheep game really, but just something of interest whilst uh, we're up in these hills. In the war time there was a British plane crashed here. Um, the, round the corner though, that hill there, there's actually two big bomb holes in the land where the pilot dropped his bombs to try and lighten us. Uh, aircraft to get up over these hills and well as you can see by that and that's a propeller sticking out there um he's just flowing straight into the face here it wouldn't have been a great ending for him <laughs> but uh that's what happens um that's also a bit of geography here too that's Orkney mainland over there um the ferry's just steaming in there to the port of Strumness which is one of the entries to the islands but yeah, uh, that's that. It's uh, deceivingly steep here. Um, I'm actually going to have to get 
do nothing to my ass here shortly. I think and slide doing this hill just in case I take it off. Luckily, I've got quite a fat arse, and I'll be all right. But uh, yeah, team today two Tess, Fern, and Duke, and that's actually Donald's dog. It's a pop of Tess. She's a young dog, new, so it's a good outing for her to get her used to this type of work. The sheep in the move now in the right direction. Uh, you'll be thinking, God, that's a long way to go for a few sheep. But uh, once you get them out of all these nooks and crannies, they'll, they'll fare and multiply on the way home. Um, but yeah, these Shetland sheep, you've, they're the most tricky sheep I've ever came across to work, really. Um, you've, got to make, you've got to make them think that they're getting away. The moment they think you've got the upper hand, they'll just they'll just bombard you and uh, just start running at you, and you'll it's just a case of like gathering what you can. But uh, yeah, they are extremely extremely tricky sheep to gather. So, folks, there's another uh, progress on today's gathering here. Well, Cammy's arrival. We we're uh, fairly successful with the first gather gather the first hill there. Got everything in. Um, we're new out on another half uh, I've had to break with the two wheeler because uh, I had a wee bit of a mess up with the four wheeler. I ended up on top of me having a wee cuddle wet. So it's just a reminder stay safe on your bikes. Always wear helmets. I'm going to film this bit anyway, we're just coming in boy, off the island of Orkney had to get a small boat, 20 minute boat journey from Orkney, Stromness in Orkney over to here and the boys are just hitching up now and we're just about to go off so I better go and grab my bags let's go Good morning sheep fans I'm Sean's baby nephew and we're clipping in Orkney today <laughs> is, that, is that big Sean? Is that Cammy? Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh. Mass, mass, my asses. Hey, mate, ah, good to see you. Good to see you. We're here, are we? <laughs> <laughs> good morning, sheep fans. How's it going? <laughs> Not too bad, what's that current? I was just trying to see less of a little bit. Proof. Mark, that's sheep proof. <laughs> <laughs> Some man. How's the bike? Haven't they told your dad? Uh, ah, it's a bit worse for wear, but it's all uh, cosmetic. Bella, <laughs> <laughs> Bella, what's wrong with you? <laughs> ah, yeah. <laughs> I'll sneak by the side there before we shut it up. Better do the proper intro here. Good morning, sheep fans. Today we are on the island of Hoy, just off the island of Orkney. We are sharing with Big Sean. This is on his run now, in his territory, the homeland. He's got to set up here pretty tight. That's actually, ah, that's the same speaker's Barry got, that's quite a good one. Yeah. Uh, I thought you had the smaller one, that's quite good. Got a little Sean's trailer here. Working with a list of machines, obviously. <laughs> hey. Looks like quite a tidy setup. Lovely smooth doors, no complaining. A little here. bit on that. Nice, nice padded bit for your knee as well. <laughs> comfort, comfort. Got a look at the sheep in here, it'll be quite dark, obviously. Old fashioned steadings, but they look pretty good going. 
for these like cheap yeah. cross. Uh, it'd be like a cheap cross Shetland. A lot of these ones, and then another group at the back, the same, and then there's about four or five hundred Shetlandy things up another shape. Like pure Shetlands? Yeah. 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 Like pure Cheevits or something, or? Yeah, and there's 11, there's 11 rams in here too. Ah, I see. I'll pull them out. Hey? I'll pull them out. <laughs> if you're fit. Come here, Alex. Alright, don't want to eat up yourself. What are we doing now, Sean? Shed off, big small, but we're kind of running out of space. So. This bedding we're putting down. <laughs> what, what kind of bedding is this? Dax and your second cut. This is the master. Unbelievable, it's come off that stand of mind this morning. I just don't know how to climb gates, so I've come in. Wooden pallets, always handy. Lambing pens, I think. I'm thinking about making wee bell here. So, as I said before, we are over on, on the island of Hoy, which is just off the coast of Orkney, very north of Scotland. It's a different world up here compared to what we're used to in the mainland. Yeah, yeah. The guys have to be pretty hardy to survive the winters here. A lot of wind, no trees in Orkney. It's so windy, apparently, although I can see a tree here. Sean did tell me there's no trees, but already I've seen one and I just looked around. Although I don't know if it's this count as Orkney. Do you get better weather? Do you get better weather here, overseas? I say the Hawaii does get better weather than us, most of the time. A wee bit, a wee bit more south. Is it not supposed to be a microclimate? That why there's so much grass. <laughs> you want a lift in it? Alright, you just do my thing. So, aye, so Hawaii's a small island. How many people live here? Donald, do you can. How many folk live here? 300? So 300 people living on Hoy. What they like, are they alright? <laughs> <laughs> do, do you know them all? Ah, you must do, you must do. It's quite a tight. So 300 people live on this island that we're sharing on today. So there's a, a damn sight more sheep than there is people. And we've got about 650 to 1000, Sean's no idea. Um, but it's not, nah, about 650 I think he's saying on this place and we're just going to go and get the next batch in. We've done the first two batches, there was a... Uh, batch in, or just not in, sorry, we're just going to shed it. Yeah. Sorry Sean. Sean was up till the on time last night, he's told me about three times. He was up to 11 last night getting them in, helping Donald get them in. So here we go. Good to see all these old fashioned steads Stand the other side of that gate. Please aye, please, yep. Get another boot there. Talk to me now. Pillows. Not gonna lie, I thought that dog was tied up, so when it jumped out the window there, I'm like standing still, like, oh man, I hope you're not aggressive. But it turns out it's just went to work. And it doesn't like GoPros. Are you need the peep in there? No, 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 I'm just gonna say a great use here of a, a, a Crystal Lakes tub lid. <laughs> just if you need to patch it with a bottom of the door. If you is. We're a source for an island. Uh, you remember that ramp I made for you? Um, oh, yeah, yeah. Is that one of the best things you've ever made? No, oh, it's probably one of the worst things I've ever made. <laughs> box of rubbish. Oh, we all remember that. Ah, oh, box of rubbish, that was a good pallet. Good <laughs> good materials I provided you with. Yeah. She live in there? Oh. Aye. Oh, oh, oh. I'll go do it and come back to them. Right, come here.
Ich hab den 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 I'm getting this for you house. Just we'll put them in the pan and heave them. Over that gate. Just want the four woolly sheep. Well, I was just wondering there, how did there come to be four sheep in with the lambs? What happened uh, there? Is that know. Sean? Yeah, it's Sean's fault. Ah, yeah, I thought that. I Everything's out of Usually it's Sean's fault. Passion on there. Rush, rush, rush. Is that Baylor twine? Yeah. I've heard the folk using Farmer's that. Farmer's friend. I've heard the folk using that. So that's the end of day 63 for me and I've got to tell you something. I've done over 10,000. Well over 10,000 now I think. My total's on the screen here. I did 343 today, uh, 6 of them on total at this farm. And I've been slack I was slacking with the videos and I wasn't keeping a notice of my tally and then when I counted up the tally I saw it was already over 10,000 because we had a, there's going to be a gap of a few days. This video you're going to watch just now, there'll be a few days I haven't done videos. So apologies for that, I lost a bit of the height. This is my confession now. I'm over 10,000. Tally's on the screen there. Pretty much smashed it. And that was way quite a few days off. I'll put the, the days I've had there. I must have had maybe seven days off or something like that, so it's been pretty easy going this season, if I'm honest. It hasn't felt difficult at all. I've enjoyed... Aye, I've just never really worked that hard, if I'm perfectly honest with you. It's been really good fun. And we've been about, I'm over in Hoy just now. It's a shame I came to see the... I came to see the mountains, but it looks like I've missed them. See what I did there? Because of the mist. <laughs> anyway, we're finished here for the day. Trailer's packed up. We're going to the next farm. We're just talking about the dinner table there. Apparently, that farmer's got around 1800. So, that could be a couple of days' work for me and Sean. I said I hadn't worked that hard yet. That could be the start. Anyway, oh, here we go. Yeah. Child. He's quite a child. He acts a big man like that, but he's too feared to tell his dad that he rolled a bike on the hill up there. Big hardy Sean. Fear of even bigger Michael. Can't wait to get a scalped ass when he goes home. And also he, he is quite good at fixing things as you saw when he made that ramp. So I'm guessing he's gonna try and fix the bike up and then not tell his dad. So Michael if you're watching this, Sean rolled a bike on high. Being reckless. Worried sick about him. Give us a good chance just now, we're packing up. It's obviously a bit damp and drich, as we would say in Scotland, which just means like a, a wet day, kind of overcast day, drich. Just This is exactly what we would say, drich. So, have a look at Sean's trailer here. The, the ramp comes off, hitches up. So, we can a homemade job. It's on a knife for Williams base, which is quite common with Sean's trailers, a lot of boys do that. He's got his race hanging over the side here, sticks out the side. Shearing board brackets go up here. So you pull the sheep out, 
put over the other side. Similar to the ones we were initially using in the Thumbland and that big green one that was in the Thumbland video. It's a similar idea, you need to pull the sheep across to the other side. Not my favourite, but it is what it is. And now we're putting the bike on the trailer. And he's then got his scramble bike to go up, so we're going to do that next. Heavy side, I got. Are you ready? Good for six hours. Uh, done, took six hours. The hood of the iPhone's oh, no, just off the side of the Just right. Right. Have to wheel that. Right. Nope. Nope. Hang on. Wheel's turning. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. Yeah, yeah. the boy. What kind of knot is that, Sean? Could you just tell us? Uh, might not hold this rope, so but. Uh, I don't want to excuse you, I just want to know what kind of rope it is. Some sort of hitch knot. It's a lorry man's hitch, yeah. See the pressure I've put on that? Oh, frightening. Absolutely frightening. And play a tune on that. Aye. <laughs> is that just the. Uh, that's just the power of your own arms there, is it? Just that, right. that protein shake you had. Fair work. Mine are all natural. Free, I meant to say to you. Just if I knew you, no I saw you noticing. That's just all natural. <laughs> 